welcome to my kitchen. You're welcome, guys. When you open my kitchen, this is the door. I have my freezer. I put my frozen stuff. This is my switch where we turn on and off the light. Not really trying to date right now. Still trying to figure my own life out. And I don't want to love anybody else Till I learn how to fall in love with myself Maybe I'm insecure or maybe the world is the problem So this is my kitchen island here I eat is more like my dining table I guess I'm not really sure This is an L-shaped kitchen Guys, it is so hot in this kitchen because the weather today is very hot. This is a cabinet that I use to put random stuff at the top, as you can see, biscuits and everything random. Here, I like to put my trays. Um, so, yeah, here, I like it very empty. But we have a basket here that I use to put my kids' blank, um, what's it called? Apron, when they eat. Can't even remember. And um, this is. So how do I learn what I'm worth? How do I love myself? Ooh, how do I love myself? Ooh. Very random stuff go in there. So these are the ones that we are using currently as you can see where here I like to store uh, the ones we haven't used I keep them at the back and here we have our liquid milk and things that can't fit there I see it here yeah so well, this is my microwave Here is another cabinet where I keep random stuff over here and here I just like to keep my other condiments like my bama, mayonnaise and butter, um, waste bag or disposable bags just random stuff I keep in here I don't like seeing things lying around so I just put everything into the cabinet the burner, the two burners are electric why this one? Uh, this one uses gas why this are electric and this is my oven for baking that I rarely use as you can see I don't think I've used this oven I use the electric one more this one is uh, this one actually came with the cooker so I don't use this one that uses gas I use the electric more often um, hood some people call it hood some people call it expeller you can call it whatever you call it but this is my expeller. So most of my kitchen appliances, the microwave, the electric oven, and this one all came from Admira Kitchen. This was way, way back. So this kitchen is as old as six to seven years. So I got this six, seven years ago from Admira Kitchen. And it has lasted me so far, so kudos. And this is how it looks. So here I also put condiments, pepper, mangi. I just store them in this random stuff i put beef here chicken here salt crayfish random stuff and here i like to put my spices one is for stew and one is for soup that's over there um extra stuff that i'm not using i store them there extra things that my that my kids don't use like their water bottles as you can see over there and extra water healers water bottles just extra random stuff i put in there electric kettle this is from smart home this is really really nice you're slipping from my hands got me falling to pieces can't you say something easy at night it's a big room 
the days you don't come to Make plans I could see through Doesn't matter cause I know you advantage it's beautiful but it's glass and it can break this is where this is like underneath the sink so there's nothing in there I don't think like my uh, wood wooden chopper or the plastic one uh, my knife butcher knife I have like two of them this stuff random this you use to stock herbs here I have my so here I store my vegetable oils as you guys can see um empty oh empty <laughs> Empty containers. I, I used to keep this after using my two my tin tomatoes so I can use it to put to measure food. So this is one cup in Ninja. Ninja. This is one cup of curry, which you guys know is big. But yeah, this is what I used to measure my curry and my rice. Down here is my uh what is it called? Mortar and pieces. So in here I have plates. Even here too, I have plates that I hardly use so I just throw them in here um, yeah is my palm oil in bag in um, jerry can here is my granola oil this is another granola oil this is an empty container that we use for palm oil palm oil and um, here I like to put my stockfish and so it doesn't smell here I put gari so you guys can see and that's my coco yam i store it here like this and this is a bag of rice so this is where i put my onion we've eaten that onions to this level guys though we still have some here to blend um so far so this is all we have and this is how my store looks coming into the kitchen that's how the kitchen looks too Around all my questions, feel you slipping from my hands, got me falling to pieces. Okay, guys, we have come to the end of this kitchen.
kitchen tour also this is my kitchen this is where i feel this is where i cook this is where i do my magic i hope you guys enjoy this tour if you do don't forget to give this video a like share subscribe tell your friends about my channel so to you who requested that i make a tour of my kitchen i hope you'll be satisfied and i'll see you guys in my next video bye bye <laughs> look at the girl that likes singing somebody somebody me one day <laughs> That's the camera woman that has been in charge of this filming, okay? Give her some credit. Say <laughs> something easy. At night it's a big room. On the days you don't come to, make plans I can see through. Doesn't matter cause I know you. Know.